Okay, we're going to now increase the distance of the note. So instead of being and only going up a step, we're going to actually have a bigger expanse between the two notes. And we're going to start here. So let's do real slow. First, find your note. So find those notes first. And we're going to stay on the A vowel this time. Now remember to record this and listen back and make sure that you're actually hearing this in pitch. Let's try to speed it up now. We're going to add the E vowel at the top now. Ready? It's because it's easier to close the sound down to hear E at the top. That's why I'm doing this. A -A 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 now let's try to speed it up if you can. And if you have to stop the tape and work on this first, don't feel like rushing through each one of these exercises because I'm, I'm trying to get you up to speed kind of quickly so that you have plenty to work on. Try to get the pitch as pure as you can so that when you toggle between the notes, they're as close to the relative pitch as we can get. And we have our anchor note on the bottom, which is A, and then a target note we're going to E, A, E, A, E, A. When you get really good at it, and you'll be able to go kind of quickly. Now, it might be a little too fast. If it's too fast, just skip this part. You'll get to a point where it is. Now, here's why this is important. When you go to sing a phrase, a lot of times you'll find yourself doing those kinds of things. Hey, you'll find yourself doing exactly what I just did but there's a lot more notes involved in it that make it a little bit more difficult to hear, okay? Let's continue. <laughs> 